Now this video is going to be about cobblestone. And in our area we call it crick rock. Everybody calls everything different, so uh, wherever you go it has a different name. But around here it's called crick rock. Or in other areas, cobblestone. You usually get it in crick beds because it rolls down the cricks and eventually the stone will round. But you can still face the stone, you can still chip her up. And it comes in a, all different sizes and all different ways. And you could uh, face the stone so you could use it on, uh, for like uh, cobblestone sidewalks or whatever. Now I have a little pile that I've been collecting here. I got to build a little pier with it. And uh, it's all cobblestone, it's all round. I got it out of uh, places like dumps and uh, landfills and everything around town. And it's all kind. It, it's going to be a little bit of sandstone. Here's a piece of conglomerate. It's a piece of limestone. This is a piece of limestone. It could be uh, granite, anything. But in this video, we're going to go to Denmark, which is in Scandinavia. Uh, I like the way they use it. We'll take a look at the way they use it. You could use it for anything. But uh, so here we go. We're going to Denmark. Now, this to me is the best way to put a uh, stone around your property if you just want a border. You just put the cobblestone down and then if a car hits it you don't have to worry about it you just roll it back into place and you're done another very simple way of using the cobblestones as a border I like it we're walking up the sidewalks of uh, Denmark I like the sidewalks you got to see my video on that and see they just laid the cobblestone right out no cement, just put it up, a border, I like it. Now here we have big cobblestones. They plant the ivy on top of it. Here we're at a water fountain. See how they built the water fountain out of cobblestone? Very simple. Now here's a cobblestone entranceway into a house. Here we have regular cobblestone sidewalks. Here's a cobblestone wall. Here's a picture of a cobblestone wall. Now we're walking into the center of the town. And this is the kind of pavers they use here. And sometimes you can just use cobblestone for a paver like they're using right here. This is all cobblestone. Now we're looking at a walkway right here. This is granite. This is a square cobblestone where they cut it. This is a granite stone. It's, it's squared. Here we have the cobblestone laying on the ground. They use that as pavers. And this is cobblestone, it's just all squared off. Well, if you're in the tropics, you could use coral, something simple like that. Or something simple like that, made out of coral. The whole idea is you could use anything you want to make a border, and it's inexpensive and cheap, and it works. Cobblestone for a border. It's a different kind of cobblestone. Here's an example of a cobblestone curb. Now this is laid in cement. See how nice that looks? And they didn't put any cement between the joints. So I also like that. I'm a fan of that. Now I'm building a little pier here. You can see it's out of cobblestone. What I always do is I look for something that's going to fit before I even start trimming it. And I make my corners. And I keep working it. Well, I get it where I want it, but that's a, uh, this is all cobblestone, I face it, you do what you want with it, everybody's got a different style, every mason, and uh, to get the look that they want, see that's pretty good, 
See, I get my uh, my stone ready before I, I mix the cement.